good morning i am officially in Asheville, which i'm so happy for i actually landed yesterday i had my full travel day across the country yesterday i landed here at like 6 p.m. Allie picked me up from the airport. We got dinner. We came back to her house because we stayed at her house last night and we check into our Airbnb today. Shout out to this cute guest room. But we got dinner and then we came back and watched Harry Potter and made like our own butterbeer. It was just like a very like chill start to the weekend. But now we are getting ready. We're gonna go to a coffee shop and eat some breakfast and then hopefully check into our Airbnb early this morning. So let's get ready. That makes me feel better. <laughs> okay, you haven't been intro to the vlog yet. Oh, okay. Allie! Hi! <laughs> like, everyone knows I'm here already. They saw me travel. And I did tell them this morning, after my 20 attempts, um, yep. that we got delicious food. Yep. Yapped. Made butterbeer and watched Harry Potter. Like, we're already having the best weekend. Like, now we're just adding on to it. The... The readathon. I was like the Airbnb, the readathon. <laughs> everything else. That everything we're else doing. that we like planned for. Yes. Um, Last so night was completely impromptu. Kind yeah. of. Like we didn't. Well, because you asked me if I like Harry Potter, I'm like, does this mean we're watching it all weekend? And then like I'll do like it. That. And then the butter beer. <sighs> Guys, that butter beer was so good, and she introduced me to marshmallow fluff, and then that yes, was do. that I was do. a game changer because then we ended up using it. Because we the, did um, the marshmallow fluff with the caramel. Yep, it's like caramel creamer, creamer. and we like I like mixed it together, and it's exactly like the butterbeer you get from Universal. I mean, it's like almost exact. Yeah, I'm like very upset that we discovered that because I was trying to lose weight before this, but now like it's not gonna <laughs> Came happen. Over. Came over. Who cares? <laughs> So where are we going for, okay, we're going to Wellbred Cafe. It's in Biltmore Village where we are now. And so cute. Very cute. Very, very cutesy. Very cute. <laughs> very cute. Very <laughs> Like, it's very, like, very brick. <laughs> I'm like, actually, I have a camera and I can just show you. Okay. Yeah, cute, 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 cute. Now, I'm pretty sure it's cute. We'll find out. We'll find out. It's cute either way. Cute little walk. No, like honestly, this is just such. Oh, oh, <laughs> it's giving small town. <laughs> it's giving Chestnut Springs. That's what I'm reading this for the fun. Okay, obviously we had to set up all of these snacks first. Actually, Allie did it, so collectively here, but um, we got all of our snacks set up and then we got like our s'more stuff. We got some sandwich stuff as well. I don't think I ever actually said that we're doing a 24-hour readathon. I feel like I mentioned it in previous videos, but I haven't said it in this vlog yet. So I'm here through Tuesday and we're doing a 24-hour readathon, like 12 hours today, 12 hours tomorrow. And then like we have all of Monday to like hang out and explore the area as well. So. That's why we're like set up with some goodies. Um, and so we're like prepping for all of that. We like just brought in all of our stuff. We have like our book stuff over there. And now we're gonna do like all the intros to all of the TikToks, the vlogs, all of that. Okay, one thing about me, I'm gonna mess up my SD cards. I just want to switch it so I could give you guys an update and learned I've been filming my 24 hour readathon on this SD card all day. So, we love that, but it's now a little after midnight. We've had our first day of the 24 hour readathon. Honestly, I'm tired, but I just wanted to pop in, say hello, very successful day, and I will just see you guys in the morning. 
we just got to farewell cafe coffee whatever so we're on day two of the readathon yep and like it's just best to kind of change your environment and like do different things to like, keep going so you started a new book yep this summer will be yep this different. summer will be different because last night i finished heartless and yep. heartstopper a lot of hearts and then today started this summer will be different 50 pages yep. in it's really really good yeah so when she was starting that i was finishing the north wind so now that i finished that i'm like okay now we can actually leave and like yeah. start our day yeah so we're just gonna come here read a bit and then I also need to film for the other vlog, but I wanted to keep you guys updated. Yes. Um, we have finished the readathon though. Yep. And we are getting well earned Mexican food. Yep. So of we're course. at Papa's and Beer. Papa's and Beer. Yep. And so is this like a like iconic place in Asheville, or just like yeah. it's a you favorite for sure? I think it's definitely probably one of the more popular restaurants here. I think that like there's two maybe okay. here, and. I don't know, at least in my knowledge. The Yelp pictures look great. So yeah. I love Mexican and I'm starving, so we're gonna go eat. Good morning, happy Monday. It's about 10 a.m. or so, and so we are like getting ready for the day. We're doing all of the Airbnb checkout process. Kind of had a slow morning, like as you guys saw, like I made a cup of coffee. I mean, desperate times call for desperate measures. You know, I'm not much of a hot coffee drinker, especially just like on a whim. But I was like, no, like I'm definitely feeling a bit tired after the like two days of reading so much and like not a ton of sleep. So had that, enjoyed like being outside. I'm sure you can kind of like hear the different nature sounds. The, like creek stream right over there like it's so peaceful out here I'm like no this is what peace sounds like so like I said we're getting ready and then we're gonna do all the checkout process of the Airbnb and we're gonna do all the outros we need to for like YouTube videos that we filmed here as like the readathon or any TikToks or anything like that's more her side I like film reels occasionally but like she's so good at like the TikTok side so we filmed some stuff over there I'll link it even though like obviously I don't even know how to link it, but I'll figure out how to link it because like her TikToks were so, so good. I was like obsessed. I'm like, oh, okay. Like I do the Instagram reels occasionally. So it's like, I understand the process, but like she had a vision and it so came to life. So we're going to do all of that. And then now we're done with the readathon. So it's just going to be enjoying Asheville today. I fly out tomorrow. So she's going to take me around to some of her favorite spots today. We're going to go get brunch, walk around different areas, go to bookstores, all of that. So I will probably just see you guys after we're checked out and heading wherever the first destination is. Okay, hello, hi. We just finished eating and then we stopped at, what is it, Dripolator? Yep. Adorable. So we're in like yep. Black, Black Mountain. Black Mountain. Um, it's just like a town near where we were. So we're just like stopping here, we were getting brunch, which was literally so divine. So good. It was so good. So I good. very waffle. You had chocolate chip pancakes. The batter was like, I think it was the batter is what it was. Ugh. Yeah. For what? Like, that's what I want to know is like, for what? <laughs> um, and then we purposely didn't get any like coffee or anything at the brunch spot because we knew we were going to be around so many. Yeah. But you're sitting on my matcha. You're sitting. And um, okay, so now we're going to go to a bookstore that is in the same area. And then we're going to head down to like downtown Asheville to go mm. to some more places. Yep. So. 
I'm excited to see what this store has. Like, I don't know the vibes of it. Like, I don't know what their selection is gonna be. I don't even know the vibes of it. I've never been. Yeah, so she's <laughs> actually new to this one too. So I'm so excited for us to discover it together. This and is after... literally laziness of me not waiting to hold my camera, by the way. No, I think so, it's good. I'm like, this is the only one out of all the ones we're going to today that I haven't been to because okay. the other ones I'm like, so, like I'm only taking you to like the good ones. Thank you. Because there's some other ones, but it's like not good. Not the vibes. The used bookstore is really where it's at though because we get I'm so many excited. deals. So yeah. we're going to stop by this new one and then after that is when we're going to stop by the used one and then head into downtown Asheville. Yeah. So we will see you yes. at the bookstore. Okay, we just got out of, wait, where, where were we at? That was Sassafras. Sassafras. Books. That was like cool. I got some clips for you guys for sure. It's definitely like, it's a unique, it's not just like a bookstore. It's like, it's like a stuff. Souvenir store. For like yes. really, all, it had like so for many like the book community. Stuff. Yeah. Which so, was, it was I fun. I love that. And I mean, they, they had good options. I'm just like, at full price, I don't want to just buy books to buy books today. Yeah. So why, wait, so that is why, there are your words, yep. we're at Mr. K's like, used bookstore. They have one in Asheville and in Grateful, South Carolina. Mm. They have two locations. Um, I don't know if that one's bigger, but this one is like so unassuming, but just trust. Like if you're ever in Asheville, please stop in here because it's, yeah. It's, I'm so excited. Yeah. So we're going to go in. I have like a list of four books that I'm interested in. We're going to see if they have them. And if they don't, like I'm going to buy something because I won't be able to help myself because I use books. Use books. Like, like on a, it's girl map that like you have to get them because they're discounted. Yeah. Like in my head, they become free at some point. So yeah. let's go in. Okay, the Mr. K's used bookstore was a success. And so now you're yes. not. I was like, I don't want to put you in it when you're like in a <laughs> compromised position. I know, I'm like searching for going. Um, it was a success. And honestly, thanks to Allie, because she got me Twisted Crowns that I thought was only going to be like yep. the full price. And she's like... Babes, Actually, here, you go. here it is for nine dollars. Yeah, so that was one of the ones on my list, and then I ended up picking up another one. So very successful, and like you got a few books. We'll like oh, show yeah. them later. Like, yeah. We'll just when we ever hit a stopping point today. Yeah. So <laughs> for now, we are downtown, and we are going to search them in Malaprops Bookstore. Um. Yep, downtown. This is like one of two really good ones. There's another one called Battery Park Book Exchange. It's not open on Mondays. And that one's like more for the vibes anyways. You're not going to really get too yeah, many books. It's not like a ton of book options. But it's, it's more like, like a, a lounge and a champagne bar yes. for the most part. But it is like a really cool vibe. It's just not where like we're going to... it's for the book lovers. Yes. But like it's more for the bar champagne vibe. Yes. So exactly. we're going to go there and like I'm going to walk around a little bit. I'd hope to, I'm hoping to find like a t-shirt or like a sweatshirt to take with me. So that's my next goal after like the three books I'm kind of interested in finding so yeah yes. let's go Like literally, where would we be if we didn't go to a barn? Like, we had to go to at least one. At least one. So this one's huge. It's huge. It's my favorite. It's been my favorite actually since I was like seven years old. I've been going to this one since I was like so young. That's crazy to me. Yeah. So we're just gonna go. We have like an hour or so that we're just gonna walk around and then like chill out a bit. So let's go. We just spent an hour, right? Like an hour, yeah, hour and a half in really Barnes. Nice. It was, was it really was. So um, the one book I did find that I wanted was not pretty. It yeah. had a human on the cover and like it's not, it doesn't match the same edition that I have of Daughter of the Pirate King. Yeah. So therefore I don't, I didn't buy it. And then we just started going through all of our pictures There's and videos. There's a lot. And we so, have a lot. And if you guys like don't have like a shared album with your friends, please do it. Like it makes life so much easier. I'm doing that from now on for sure. Yeah, as you should. Like I have friends like that I just like hang out with regularly, so we're regularly taking pictures. I'm like, please don't send me 15. Like, and don't feel like 
you don't want to send me 15 so you only send me like five like i want all 15 yeah just make it easier so yeah. we just did that and like i was just like going through all of them it was a lot of work and you edited a tiktok yeah i did, did yeah it? i it's like almost posted so it should be posted by the time we get to dinner it takes a little while to load, but I got it edited. So it's and going that's out. half the battle. Yeah. So now we're going to get sushi. So the plan is sushi, mm-hmm. grab crumble, go to like a little yes. picnic vibe. Yes. So and we honestly, there's so many places that we could stop, um, because we're going on the Parkway, Blue Ridge Parkway. So we can really just like we can find a good spot and it just like they have a lot of like pull, lookout. Perfect. Perfect. Okay. So right now sushi. Life is a winding road No telling where it goes Driving through days and nights Won't stop for traffic lights And I, I really wanna know really 